Hello guys, what's up? I'm Brian here doing another video for you guys and this time it's another Before It's Out video. Now if you guys don't know what Before It's Out is, basically it's a web series where I'm taking a look at a Transformers toy before it gets released. And today we are taking a look at the Transformers Cyberverse Ultra Class Bumblebee. So take it, uh, take everything with a grain of salt. Um, and I'm also going to make the argument, I'm not going to go into too much detail because I already talked about it in the Scout Class video. Um, some people are saying, hey, you shouldn't really talk about them or, or criticize these Cyberverse toys because they're, they're meant for little kids. Uh, first of all, at what point do you draw the line with kids' toys because all this is also kids' toys? Um, sorry. A and, uh, two, I have some one-step changers and I'm fine with those. A and three, I was a kid at some point, so I can get into that and criticize these toys, um, and, and base that uh, from that point of view, a and I just want to share my opinion on some Transformers toys, you know, I, I don't think that's a problem. If, if you like them and you want to buy your kid a toy, that's fine, but I am going to share my opinion on these. So, taking a look at the Bumblebee, um, I kind of like the paint applications, I mean, you got some uh, paint on the bumper, some paint on the spoiler, I think that's good, uh, nothing in the rims, unfortunately. Uh, you do have a couple of black stripes. I wish there was more with that, uh, just to give them a little bit more color. But I, I do like the shaping. I do like the styling. Uh, you do get the light blue in the uh, the headlights. And it almost seems a little fake just because they paint the whole thing light blue. It just seems like it, it's just slapped on. I don't know. Um, it, it's always weird to me with the, the light blue. I, I don't know. There's, there's something that... There's something with that that just looks like it's globbed on. I, I can't be the only one who thinks that. It, it just looks like paint that's been bubbled up. Um, uh, but the grill section looks fine. You know, the alt mode, for what it is, isn't too bad. Um, apparently there's a gimmick, I guess, you do something with the spoiler. That's my guess. I didn't really read the description. I guess I should have. Um, but uh, there is a gimmick, I believe, where you can release these missile launchers from the back um, and the missile launchers just look like these white and green things they're nothing really too much I don't know they're just not my thing um, and then take a look at the robot mode you know what it reminds me of is Transformers Cyberverse Hotshot but if they didn't put as much effort into it um, I kind of like the shaping I, I like the general look of him for the most part I don't like the feet just because they just look like flat pieces of plastic. I don't know. It just looks like someone took a rolling pin to the legs. Um, and then he's got a giant backpack. Now, if they were to reverse it like the Hotshot figure, um, I think, oh, cool, that's a, that's a reference to Hotshot. I, I like that they're doing that, but uh, no, they decided not to. And I just think it doesn't look good because it looks like a giant cape. I don't know. It just it doesn't look good. Uh, the head design, I don't know if I can get into it. I, I know what they're going for, but I, I'm i just not sure if it really looks good. Um, I think overall, it's not necessarily a bad toy or anything new, because it does remind me of some of the R.A.D. Bumblebee toys, like the, the one that came with the Activator Minicon, but um, I just I can't get into it. I, I really can't. I think for kids it might be okay because it does have a pretty okay action feature. Um, I'm not sure if you can incorporate that into the robot mode, but at least alt mode you can have a little fun with that. Um, but just overall, I can't get into it personally. So with that said, uh, I thank you guys for watching. What is your opinion? Please comment below. I want to hear. Uh, with that out of the way, uh, I thank you guys for watching. Please like, comment, share, subscribe, and all those fun dudes, and I'll see you guys next time.